Hello, my name is Yohan and I'm a South African sysadmin. Today I'm in our apartment because today is public holiday in Rasa and I thought I still want to make a video and as you can see the sun is shining beautifully like this is, this is the first time this year in, um, in Rasa and I hope, I really hope that it doesn't bother the picture too much because I'm happy about it. And yes, I was thinking, should I make a blog, to, blog today or not? But then I thought, yes, sure, why not? And there's big news in the Linux Mint world because last night there came a new month of a blog out, which is, of course, because it always comes at the, at the end of the month. But they gave us news on Linux Mint 18.2. It's always exciting. So we now know what the code name is going to be. It's going to be Sonia. It always is a girl's name. And as for me, I kind of expected an S name because it's really, um, it looks like the 18 series, like 18, 18.1, 18.2, and I guess 18.3 will all be names start, starting with an S. Sarah, Serena, and now Sonia. Normally, like, it's always a, like a famous woman, like Serena's, the tennis player Serena, um, Serena Williams, it's always like somebody famous they make, but this time it's slightly different as one of the developers of Linux Mint, his wife, has called Sonia died not so long ago, passed away, and it's in remembrance of her, which is quite cool. If you want more information about this, Release and other news about management. Please find the find the find the link to the blog blog post in the description of the video, which you can find at the bottom. So yeah, so it's pretty cool. Other news about it is we are going to get the same like greater than what we are used to in Ubuntu, like stock Ubuntu. They changed it from the one that's in Linux Mint to the one that this is stock Ubuntu. It's a pretty cool idea. So you can get much easier, I presume, get much easier, like different desktop interfaces installed and just quickly choose between the ones, which is quite, quite nice. Interesting step, but quite nice. Other things is quite, this is the main thing for 18.2, there's no release dates, but Keep an eye on my page, my channel, and as soon as beta is being released, in the full version, I'll keep you posted. And when the full version is released, I will make blogs about it. You know, like, like little tutorials also about it. So, and it's, it's gonna be soon. I'm pretty sure about it because, like, in the past, it always like a month or two after. And the Ubuntu release, the Linux Mint comes. And as we all know, Linux Mint, like the 18 series, if you can call it the 18 series, they are all based on Ubuntu 16.4. And, oh, one more thing. Cinnamon 3.4 will be in, um, in Linux Mint 18.2, and I can't wait to see it. I don't think it's out there yet. I'm keeping my eye on it. So, as soon as it's been released, you can see it in, and you can install it in any distro. I'll be there for you. <laughs> yeah, but yes, yes, and uh, LMDE Linux Mint Debian Edition. It's the Matei release will come out with with how do you call it again? Um, made one point eighteen. It's been brought out to it. And it's quite an interesting release because 1.18 Mate is mainly GTK3 and Linux Mint will keep it to, as I, as I understood the post, the blog, they will keep it to GTK2. So it's going to be interesting to see how it's going to work out. I can't wait. It's the first release like this and it's still so exciting in my heart to see what the guys will do as always because it's but the Linux Mint 18.2, as far as I get it, will not run um, Ubuntu Mate 1.18 because it's based on 16.4 and 16.4 Mate 
I believe is based on Matei 1.12. So we will not see 1.18 yet in Sonia, but that's okay. I think like the LMDE Betsy is like a test mode where they test it out that when Linux Mint 19 comes out, we're gonna have the latest of Mate in a great form. Linux Mint. Yeah, I thought this gonna be a short block, 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 <laughs> but it's pretty average block. So thank you for watching. See you tomorrow and goodbye.